Oh, the second Blade Boys. Let's go. We're on the drop rate again. Yeah, we earned this one too. Hell yeah. Let's fucking go. Second one. Okay, cool. Well, now we're caught up on the blade. Now we just gotta catch up on the armor C. We're like eight behind. And uh, yeah, also catch up on the pet. So if you look at the right, I have tried 399 gauntlets. And uh, I did get a blade. And I did get five armor seeds. So this is a pretty solid approximation of how much money you're probably gonna be making currently. If you do enough to get a blade on average. So we're looking at 249 mil profit. Now, if uh, you factor in crystal shards, that could be anywhere from like uh, 20 to like 40 mil and uh, include a few crystal armor seeds because I'm behind on those. Yeah, we're talking around 300 mil, give or take, for getting the blade on average. So yeah, it's pretty damn, damn nice, guys. So in the long run, every gauntlet run is worth actually quite a lot, man. 750,000 GP on average, man. That's actually in insane insane dude that's so cool though man I, I forgot you can even wear the uh uncharged version dude the uncharged version looks so good right i wish i can just change my infinite blade into the white color that'd be that'd be actually super dang dude ah oh, shit i already lost my aggro gotta be aggro again oh what the f oh my god dude we just got the third blade <laughs> Ah, that's insane, dude. Oh, there we go. Our luck is turning around, boys. Let's get it. Huh. Damn, there we go. Now now we're actually... Uh, we're doing really good on, on the uh, blade. 979. Oh, armor seat. Yay. Let's go. First good drop of the day. Got some armor seats. Not a bad session. I did three and a half hours and we got psych. You wish it was 300 mil. We got this much six mil, zero deaths, uh, crystal armor seed. Pretty normal here. So, just with the armor seed, you know, we were, we were packing like a bit over two mil an hour. All right, shit. Wasn't recording. Bad YouTuber. Uh, anyways, we hit the 1000. Some great shit happened. Uh, I'm probably gonna have to just take some clips off the VOD or something, but yeah. The 1000, I uh, got another armor C number 14, so we're like six behind on the right. Also had a new PV, that was sick. We got 710, so hopefully I have some clips for y'all for that. But yeah, man, no pet. So we are uh, 200 over the right now. Hit the four digit ca uh, kill count, so that's cool. I can usually tell if my run is going to be insanely fast, if I can find the Dark Beast and the Bear and get all my prep stuff like the Shards 220 and also some food all in the same loop, which is the first loop. But anyways, I went to the boss with about 3 minutes and 30 seconds left on the timer and then I finished the boss in around 320. So the boss fight can be as fast as sub 3 minutes. So I still have like a theoretical 20 to 30 seconds that can shave off in terms of PB, but 710 is pretty nice though, I'll take it. I'm gonna give you guys one big tip at the Hunlift that will help you if you're going for the blade yourself. So you really wanna try your best to stand in the middle of the room as much as possible because that is the easiest way to avoid tornado damage and also to maximize DPS. So tornadoes have a very high chance to spawn near the corners which is why you don't want to stand on the corners. Even though some of you guys might think it's safer that way, it's actually not. And another big plus to standing in the middle is that the tornadoes will slowly make their way towards you and converge into a single line. It will give you more time to DPS while they're coming towards you. And also once they converge, they'll be in one single spot. So that way you don't have to track multiple tornadoes at the same time. Risky move, but I, I was pretty confident on the timing there. So on the right is the total loot from all the gods I've done so far since coming back uh, post blade. So we got two extra blades, nine armor seeds, eight weapon seeds, and uh, that totals around 400 million GP with all the uh, other alcohols and runes and stuff. And an extra probably 40, 60 mil on crystal shards. So looking for this pet is quite profitable. I mean, I could drop trade these in the future if I need money, but for now we'll keep it. So let's see what this loot tab's looking like by the time I finish the pet. We got a uh, master clue. Here we go. Come on. 
Oh, nice. Holy shit, I was able to get three hits on that one. And it still didn't manage to, uh, to touch the pillar. Oh, I can't believe it. In 600 solos, man, I've never seen my claw completely miss Parasites. That's the first time that's ever happened. This is KC17. Are you kidding me, bro? Damn, bro. Nice. That was a really good kill for uh, 1,700, man. Jeez. I'm going to wait for this thing to show up. Oh, fuck. Oh, I died. No. Fatality. Ah, oh, dang it. I, I was too... I, I paid too much attention to the Parasite. Dang, my first death in a while, dude. Oh, that was sick, man. I dodged the melee attack and went for the claw spike. That was clean. So I'm trying to find ways to optimize my DPS more by using claw specials more. And uh, at the start of the nightmare fight, you can either get the HUD special as the first special or the flower special. If I get the HUD special, I take more damage, so I need my SGS more. But if I get the flower special, I don't take damage from that. So I can use my claws instead, and that's extra deeps. Please, I'm crying. Give me a drop, please. Come on. Please. Oh, I got a PB! Woohoo! Easy, boys! I don't even notice that it was that fast of a kill, but I got a PB. Nice. 1627. So, 1631 was the my fastest time. Now we got 1627. Oh my god, please. Yo, Parasite. Ha! Ah, damn it, dude. Oh my god, so unlucky. Jesus! 73... 60 like something 80 bro F off parasite this was a really good kill oh my god i pb'd what <laughs> what 1605 are you kidding me bro i didn't even realize that was such a fast kill that's nuts wow that's crazy 1605 dude 2000 charges yeah i should just do it now honestly Oh, man. This hurts every time to do. Honestly. Here we go. Let's charge it back to full. Alright, this should last me a little while. But, yeah, we're just gonna keep doing the room crafting on our free time. I gotta be really fa fast. What the fuck is the boss? I can't see it. Oh, no. I think I just glitched the boss. God damn it. I literally went in too fast and it disappeared. Feels bad, man. That was, that was awkward as hell. Alright, yo, let's open it up. Here we go. Oh my lord. Another robe, uh, hood of darkness or whatever. Oh, we got an archer's ring. Cool. Good start to the, uh, to the task. People are like, yo, man, you only bring two prayer pots to, uh, your DK's task? Yeah, man, I, I still haven't used the prayer dose yet. It's such a joke, you know, with my, uh, 400 range defense setup. It's disgusting. Dude, the Guardian Boots pretty much pimped out, like, finished the setup for me. Rest in peace points. Oh, shit, I got a Zuck task. Let's go. Alright, I haven't done Zuck in a while. Uh, the melee free is pretty clutch, though. I don't want that guy running around like crazy. Am I not the daddy? Oh, such a good spawn. Life is good. Life is good, boys. Yes, that's beautiful, bro. Thank you. All right. Um, this is a really hard phase, bro. What the fuck? Okay, I know what to do. That was really sketch, bro. Alright, I think I got it. Oh, damn, that healer phase really, uh, really screwed me over. I didn't handle that healer phase too well, so... Oof, okay, that's good. But yeah, let's go. Let's get it, man. Let's cash this in. Alright, what? Yeah, oh, no gel net, rip, rip, rip. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. But we are slowly getting closer to the drop rate. One day, one day. If you guys enjoyed today's video, definitely consider giving it a like. But yeah, it would help out a lot in promoting 
in this video but anyways thank you guys so much for watching i do have a french chat so if you guys need a place to hang out definitely consider joining ours at mr iron bar and also consider subscribing that way you won't miss on future videos and if youtube content isn't enough i do stream all of my live progress on twitch as well so consider visiting us on twitch.tv anyways i will see you guys soon with another video take care and bye bye